The internet is growing rapidly, but at rates which can be accommodated as a current uh, rate of progress of technology. There is no crisis, uh, there is no need to do anything dramatic on the wireline internet side at least. Demand for transmission capacity is growing, still growing very fast, but the rate of growth has actually been coming down to a point where it's lower than the rate of improvement uh, offered by technology. So uh, in the case of uh, wireline connectivity, I don't really think that uh, these uh, threats of you know, metered uh, plans are likely to materialize. I think service providers would be shooting themselves in the foot. Uh, the case where the situation is different is in wireless. So what we see today uh, is explosion in uh, data usage on wireless networks, especially as more smartphones uh, are sold. Uh, this was already uh, becoming noticeable with, say, the Blackberries, and it's much more noticeable with the Apple iPhone, uh, where people tend to kind of uh, do much more with it, and to trans can download and upload much more data and that is putting a strain on the networks. And so in wireless, it could very well be that indeed we will have more uh, kind of uh, constraining um, sort of plans uh, being offered uh, to the public. Although I think the industry's concern is more with the people who upload information. So especially, uh, especially people who use pirated uh, video and uh, kind of let the machines be used for peer-to-peer -peer distribution. And in those cases, since it's not a individuals inside the household who are consumers, but potentially dozens or hundreds of people outside who are downloading off of that machine, um, traffic can really mount up very quickly. The people very, very often confuse the concept of paying by the byte or metered pricing for access to the internet with the notion of net neutrality. Uh, net neutrality uh, d demands uh, equal treatment for different types of communication, but net neutrality does not uh, forbid or does not, uh, does not rule out uh, pricing uh, by volume of transmission. Uh, so, I mean, net neutrality would say forbid a carrier from stopping you from accessing Google and forcing to you to, you, to use Yahoo for your searches, for example. Uh, but you could still charge by the byte. We have extensive experience from a variety of industries uh, which show that uh, whenever you impose any caps, then there's a fairly dramatic effect on usage caused by several factors. This has been explored fairly extensively. And in environments such as the internet, where there is an incentive set for the kind of say content providers, for application providers, but also even for the connectivity providers to encourage usage, that's likely to be detrimental to the industry.